Alright, hello folks, and welcome to, uh, part three of what if Naruto was Virgil, or trained by Virgil. Now, where we, uh, left off, I believe it was, uh, after the fight with Rock Lee, alright? After that little whole skirmish and all that, uh, I believe, you know. Rock Lee was going in, but he couldn't do much against our boy Naruto. And, uh, and, uh, pretty much, you know, got his ass whooped. Or my guy stopped the f fight. I, I don't remember. But, besides all that, besides all that, we move on to the, uh, that little riding thing Naruto pretty much did. Naruto and Dunn pretty much did. So, you know, he's pretty much, you know, doing well and everything. And Chosky's using his shot and gun to, to do his, that, to do what, what not. And I think Sakura just knew what she was doing, I guess. Nothing really different, different besides, you know, Naruto actually doing the test. <laughs> Instead of leaving the damn thing blank. So, yeah, moving on to that, moving on from that, you know what I'm saying? Naruto just, you know, finished first out of everybody, beating, uh, beating Minato's score, shocking everybody, shocking everybody, as he just, you know, leaves and whatnot, and he goes to the, uh, to where the fourth, and well, not nah, he just chills there and waits till everybody else finished. But not folks finish and folks some folks finish some folks failed, whatever, whatever, whatever. That done. Anko coming busting through the uh, busting through the uh, window and whatever, whatnot, and uh, pretty much you know tells everybody to get their get themselves to a force of death because that's where they're going to start their next test their next test so Naruto and Inko didn't really have that interaction they did in canon since you know Naruto's really just keeping to himself but there is a particular ninja there who was actually interest actually interested in Naruto Naruto a particular snake who was somehow more interested in Naruto than he, she is than Sasuke you heard me right <laughs> you heard me right and to help you visualize what I'm talking about. Wait, hold on, is it down with me? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so to give you all an idea, boom, right there. Right there. So, you know, <laughs> he ain't being chased by Michael Jackson no more. It's something different. So, uh, let's get off of that. Back to this. So, yeah. They're both. So, yeah, pretty much, uh, after they, so pretty much. So, oh, sorry. So, yeah, that's pretty much the, the one who's eyeing up our boy Naruto right now. So, mostly because, well, not for his body, but, you know, for his body. <laughs> she just wants a powerful offspring, that's all. And 
said she couldn't find a suitable mate in uh, Konoha, which is why she left. <laughs> it's the only reason why she left. I say, I'm going to say, she's going to, you know, decide, find, find a young male and, you know, make one. Pretty much, you know, giving them the curse mark to, you know, have the urge to go to Orochimaru and uh, gain even more power, which is what, you know, Naruto will end up doing. He won't have the urge, but, you know, but as you'll see. So, so they start to go in to the uh, force of death, whatnot. Everybody disappearing and they, you know, speeding off. Speeding off. But whatnot. And, you know, as they're going, they're, as they're going, they s Naruto senses that and his team are being tailed. So, he tells, you know, his, uh, his, uh, teammates to go on forward. I'm gonna go, you know, use the bathroom. Not, nah. bathroom or not. Nah, Sasuke, Sasuke's like, <laughs> whatever, loser. And Sakura's like, you know, whatever. Sakura's like, well, Take as much time as you want, cause you know she wants. You just want to be alone with freaking Sasuke, so you like whatever. So you know, kick it for Naruto. Just goes flying back, meeting the ninja that's tailing them, and you know goes on the attack. So the the ninja pulls out you know sword of her own. Then they go in, you know, Taijutsu sword battles. <laughs> sword battle. It's pretty freaking dope, you know what I'm saying? Going, Virgil going in with the speed, whatnot, you know what I'm saying? He's going on with the finesse, and, you know, he respects, and, you know, Dr. respects and enjoys fighting this person since, you know, they're another, they're also another sword fighter, but, you know. Naruto, maybe, you know, even though he's having a bit more speed, he can clearly tell that the ninja before him has a lot more experience. So, even though he's faster, even though he's faster, nah, faster, the ninja knows what, what, what she's doing. But, you know, nah, nah, Naruto is able to get a quick cut in. And that was enough for him to do, to make, you know, mimics, to make mimics or whatnot on the east side. And he does a little, you know, fast motion cuts or whatnot. Fast motion cuts, destroying the disguise on the ninja, revealing to be female Orochimaru. And Naruto pretty much asks, like, who are you? What do you want? And the female the ninja baby says like baby saying basically I am Lord Orochima and I am here for a suitable mate. And he's like, huh? And with that is with that distraction or whatnot that little distraction or whatnot, uh Hiroshima was quickly able to, you know, boom 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 do her little symbols for the curse mark and bites our boy Naruto's neck, you know, and have the curse mark and whatnot, and then just, you know, just leaves, and, you know, Naruto's on one knee, and Virgil, Virgil's seeing this little curse thing, curse mark thing, whatnot, it's just like, hmm, decides to put his energy in it, destroying, destroying Orochimaru's soul that is in it completely. And replacing it, put, replacing it with his own. So now the curse mark is has been turned into the devil mark, which allows which allows uh, 
Naruto. Naruto to uh transform transform into his you know devil trigger devil trigger but just like the first stage of it you know similar to what uh Dante had it in Devil May Cry 5 where it was that regular demon and then that big huge horn red red demon during that's basically what's gonna happen with Naruto. so he can only turn to that regular demon but eventually he will be able to transform into that demon you see on the screen but not yet so Naruto trying to take a breather or whatnot he take a breather or whatnot he chills chills there until he until uh he hears a scream from from uh, Sakura, so he goes in, rushes in, whatnot, boom, 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 and he sees on the while he's you know standing on the tree that you know Sasuke is uh, knocked out thanks to that you know sound dude using that ring Genjutsu joint because you know Sasuke did not have his curse mark, so not did not have his curse mark. And Rock Lee is kind of slow. It's not not slow. Well, he's not slow. He's just not. <laughs> he's not. You know, he didn't make that. Make it in there on time. So seeing that, you know, he still somewhat cares for Sasuke, and seeing that his, you know, partner is injured, the devil mark starts axing up. So it basically gets those little marking tattoos that Sasuke had, it, but you know, instead of black, it's more uh, a dark blue around that starts forming around uh, Virgil I mean Naruto and he is pretty basically going even faster than before boom going in and boom going in and just and whooping all those sound ninja dudes asses then the two dudes and the girl girl and the dude with the holes in his hands trying to do that little shockwave joint or whatever the hell he does on it. But, you know, it can't do nothing. Just do nothing. So, what Naruto decides to do is, ching quickly, quickly go forward through the dude. Dude uh, sheathed his sword and his arms basically fall off. And... You know, screaming in pain. Hey, the other two ninjas just, just basically see this as like, yeah, we got to retreat and, you know, bounce. Taking the dude's arms. Taking the dude's arms, knowing that, you know, uh, that uh, Orochimaru can probably fix those. Maybe. Or just reattach them. And, you know, Naruto just lets them leave because he's, you know, more worried about his teammates and all, but he was able to get the squirrels he needed to uh, beat this little test and, you know, picks up Sasuke and him and Sakura. They all go ahead. Garo Gar is already there at that little place and next comes, you know, uh, Naruto and his team and, you know, the scroll happen and they, you know, interact with the Gar the sand team and you know whatever and basically they move on to that to the next test where uh those little little fighting joints of course so you already know who it is you know we already know the matches and they happen and then it gets to you know Naruto versus Kiba Kiba real excited about this because he wants to show off to Hanada and Nanada is pretty happy, you know, but he's most she's mostly paying attention to Naruto, which is, you know, pissing uh Kiba off. So before the prompter can even say start, Kiba's already rushing in with uh, Akumaru. Akumaru. And you know, try to do that fang or a fang joint, but you know, Sasuke just dodge, dodge, dodge. I mean I saw fucking Naruto. 
and dodge, dodge, dodging, and you do nothing right. Do nothing right, and then pretty much, pretty much trying to get off guard. Uh, Akumaru he throws a kunai that hits Akumaru while he's there doing that little flying jump, hard enough to hit him in the foot, and. You know, as Akumar, because they already did that beast transformation joint where, you know, Akumar basically turns into another him. But, yeah, he throws at Akumar's foot and, you know, quickly kicking him in the gut, knocking him out. And, you know, Kiba, real pissed, isn't real pissed about this because that's his freaking dog. Isn't, you know, not thinking right. So he's just going, going, rushing in at R. So. Naruto not even thinking straight. So, as you know, as he does that, um, a mimic clone formed from behind uh, Naruto just jumps over to from his shoulder, and then boom, kicks his kicks Kiba in the face, forcing him to you know fly in the sky, and boom, Naruto jumps up, um, and then, you know hits him with the sheaf thing, hits him with the sheaf. On this in the stomach, but in the stomach, I'm hitting with hitting him with uh, hitting him in the head at the with the back of his uh, with the back with the tip of his sheath, and then when he falls on the ground, he basically he basically be full on stomps on that man, knocking him out. So Naruto wins. Naruto wins, and every other match happens. Uh, the Neji and Hanada joint is still somewhat similar, but when uh, freaking Neji was about to go in on that kill on his own fucking, <laughs> I don't know what that man was thinking. That man was crazy. He really was on some Sasuke shit. <laughs> he really was, but. When after when uh, Neji was gonna go for that kill, instead of a uh, the Jonies getting there fast and Naruto's already there, blocking Neji's hit and clack snapping his arm, snapping his arm. You know Neji's in pain, even more pissed than ever, even more pissed than ever, and you know and. Hanada collapses. The medics come in to get her and whatnot, and they re get her and whatnot. You know, Naruto is just you know, is more pissed. Just you know, getting pissed. That's how you know his the fr his friends. You know, the ones who who are really care about him the most. Because let's say the village still has like. No respect for Naruto, but that's for now. But that's just for now. He's just not enjoying the fact that you know his friends are getting hurt, and you know it's making his curse mark act up. And then with the Rock Lee and Gara joining, you know, freaking Gara breaking, snapping, snapping a. Uh, Neji's not Neji Rock Lee's arm and leg you know what I'm saying that's only that only pissed off Naruto even more so he wants two dudes to take that one right now so you know that pretty much happens what not Naruto Naruto everybody else leaving to get ready for the next matches with the true Chuni is in what not and uh Naruto goes off to, you know, train and whatnot. Hold on. What the hell is that? Hang on. <sighs> Sorry about that. Somebody left on the alarm without turning it off. So I had to go and turn it off real quick. So... Anyway, Naruto goes to uh, to do his training and whatnot, but decides, you know, take a bath before that. Because why not take a bath before you start training, you know, relax before you start working hard. 
but before you know he can go see it fast he sees a white haired man peeping on the girls packaging and Naruto not really caring that much but you know still is a little annoyed about it Hex Hex you know the man says you know stop what you're doing and Jiraiya um, yeah, you already know Jiraiya looking back sees Naruto and kind of a bit shocked you know he's not the the yellow haired goofball that he heard heard about but more strict and more strict than ever more strict and you know controlling to him so, I don't know more tame <laughs> I guess you could say chill but sturdy and serious and power hungry <laughs> that's basically I mean despite you know Naruto he thinks he is gonna be he wants to be a Hokage and he will achieve it and he, he, and he wants to achieve that dream no matter what but he want, he doesn't want to be just the Hokage he wants to be the strongest Kage to ever exist. And he's gonna make that happen no matter what. And no matter who he has to kill. Friend or foe. <laughs> but you know. No, you know. You're dry recognizing him. Pretty much, you know. Just not be around a bush and wants to train Naruto. So. So, sh but you know, not too shocked about you know his new transformation because let's just say Jirai already spoke to the third Hokage and he told uh, Jirai everything about what happened to Naruto and the fact that you know the Nine Tails is not really the Nine Tails and it's you know completely something else. And, you know, decide to, instead of, you know, teaching Naruto the summoning jutsu already, he uh, decides to, you know, teach Naruto the Rasenga. And, you know, Naruto basically achieves this joint in a, in a week, I guess. Or well, shorter, whatever. But... There's a difference between since you know, nah, devil, tr devil trigger energy, demonic power always courses through his, through his chakra. Also, his machine a little different. So, you know those little spinning blades that be forming around, uh, that can form around a. Uh, uh, Virgil well when Naruto does the Rasengan a few like six swords form around it and you know start spitting around the uh, around the uh, thing around the Rasengan and that's something you know he can basically throw And control where it goes completely. So that's his new devil trigger Rasinga. And that's basically what he learns learns before the you know he exams with Neji. And I think Yeah, I'm gonna stop it here. I'm gonna stop it here. I'm sorry. Should probably get to you know the truly examining, you know. And I'll I'll save that for the next next part. I'll save that for the next part. But you know for now, I hope you enjoy. You know, if you want to share the video to other folks, if you want, I mean that'll be fine. That's only if you want. To. I'm not gonna force you, which. Well, technically, I literally can't, so me saying I'm not going to force you <laughs> means nothing. But, 
you know, I just, you know, I hope you enjoyed. And, you know, goodbye. Uh, me. And this.